Hello, today we are on Scarborough Beach, State Beach in Maine, and it's a great day. And I love this beach because it's a little wilder and there's lots of stuff that seems to have come in on the waves. So it's really interesting to look and see what we can find. And I'll show you a sample. So check out this stuff. All right, first of all, I found a great piece of driftwood here. And on it, I've got all kinds of treasures. So we've got some nice big horse mussels horse mussels, right? And that I find on these northern Maine beaches a lot. Beautiful, beautiful samples of those. I found an enormous common periwinkle. And one of the things I really like about this beach are the stones. There's all kinds of beautiful beach stones. Whenever I see these, I think of little landscapes. See there's one here too? Just lots of nice stones. There's another one. And then I found some eastern oysters. So there's a nice eastern oyster. Lots of crab carapaces. This one looks like a rock crab. Oh no, possibly a green because it's tapered. I've got some nice little moon snails. In fact, I found that if I really got down low in some of the piles of shells, there was lots of beautiful little tiny shells. So those are really sweet. And then we've got some crab claws here. That looks like the Jonah crab claw. And a lot of nice pebbles again. This one, I'm kind of stumped. I think it's a leucine clam or leucine shell, but I got to double check on that and I'll put that in the comments below the video, okay, to get, or the description so that I can tell you what that is. Piece of a uh, sand dollar, another eastern oyster, and look at these beautiful stones. And I don't know if you can look at this one. That one's gorgeous. That's a big triangle. Love that one. But you know, I was looking at these stones and I was thinking they look like eggs, right? And we've got piping plovers nesting on the beaches right now. And I thought that is a great stone to leave on the beach. It helps camouflage the eggs. Another nice stone. In fact, right now I'm doing a little research on stones, but I've got a lot to learn before I can tell you what everything is. And then look at the baby lobster claw. So cute. Beautiful blue mussels. More horse mussels. Jackknife clam, slipper shells from the slipper snail. And then again, here's some beauties, little adorable little snails, um, the dog winkle. And I love when they're striped like that, right? So that's a dog winkle, a couple of little ones there. More beautiful shell, uh, pebbles. They look like butterscotch to me. Oh, and here's a nice piece of a sand dollar. And another little crab carapace, a little surf clam piece of plastic and a beautiful piece of birch bark that, you know, again, like if you look on this beach where all the, the uh, seaweeds piled up, there's all kinds of great stuff and driftwood and feathers and bones. But the thing I want to say is when you go to a state beach, be very careful of what you keep because there's different laws about what you can take. Okay. So just be aware of that. I'm not sure about this beach, so I won't take anything. But um, I will look it up and I'll put it in the uh, description. And the feather that looks like a, a big black uh, gull, black back gull. I bet you that's what that's from. Anyways, lots of great stuff. Lovely beach. I hope you enjoy the view. Thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, subscribing, you know, all that.